We now return to Let's Play Battletech. Okay, we're going to our next mission, Extraction. Traveling, travel to Guldra to rescue Lord Alexander Madeira and recover his family's insurance policy. By your command. <sighs> Got all of our thunderbolts in the bays. It's okay. Job's done. Distress call. Sumeria catches your attention on the bridge. Commander, I've picked up a distress call from a nearby civilian transport. It's not exactly our job to assist, but we may be the nearest ship available. She studies the display. On the other hand, it looks like the ship's engines are in a critical state. They could explode before we get there. Mount a rescue mission. We'll try. When the Argo arrives at the source of the distress beacon, it's clear you made the right decision. A handful of void-suited passengers spin aimlessly away from a gaping hole in the hull, hoping against hope for rescue. Your tech staff manages to scoop up the survivors before the transport explodes. Your reputation is more than we have at max, but we have an increased morale. So that's good. We're already maxed out on rep with them, I'm pretty sure, so that doesn't count for much for me. Hey boss, we've just completed those upgrades. All right. Finally. Let's just go. Dead drop in orbit around Guldra. We're picking up a transmission on the restoration dif distress frequency, Commander. The timestamp is marked a couple hours ago from Lord Madeira. Kamea, by the time you receive this, all have been captured. I've got hostiles closing in around me as I'm recording this. I don't know how much time I have left. The evidence I, the evidence is hidden in a dead drop. Is the best I could do given the circumstances. Go to my grandfather's monument, the place w where we laid him to rest. The directorates paved it over and built a structure over top of it. Look there, and you'll find what you need. I can hear the sound of splintering hardwood. They're coming through the door. I pray I see you again, but if I don't, I need you to win this war. Do whatever you do can to finish it. Okay. Well, let's start putting together a rescue team. Leave space for me, Lone Wolf. I'm coming with you. First we recover Alexander, then we focus on picking up evidence. Okay. I've got Lord Madeira's transponder signal on my screen. They're moving him into an APC. If we launch mechs now, we'll catch him. Then we better move. Assemble your lance. Three of your best. I'll be joining you in the Atlas. Good. Time is of the essence. Let's retrieve the evidence and bring Lord Madeira home. Because if she was bringing the Kintaro, we were going to have problems. Uh, this is about the best I can do, so I think we'll take Glitch, though, in the Lone Wolf. Or in the Highlander, rather, just because she's got better stats. So we'll take the A-Team. Uh, maybe I should swap her. What do you think? Yeah, let's do that. Okay. <sighs> Seriously, the majority of this game is waiting. It's pretty terrible. The Directorate has captured Lord Madeira, and we're going to get him back. We have his transponder coordinates, and we know he's on the move. We're going to make Planetfall rescue Alexander and recover the evidence he risked his life to bring us. It will bring ruin to anyone who stands in our way. Lady Arano said it all, Gaz. We don't have... We don't leave our people behind, and Lord Madeira's an important asset to the Restoration. He's on our crew. Let's go get him. Command interface initiated. How we looking, Darius? You're approaching the convoy. Alexander's locator puts him in the APC in the middle of the group. It's surrounded by a pack of armed escorts. How close are they the refu to the refueling depot? Close. From directorate transmissions we've intercepted, I can tell you there's a small group of attack vehicles. 
Waiting at the depot. The good news is their communications are down and they're prepping to depart for a local repair yard. If you engage the convoy outside the attack vehicle's sensor range, they should depart on their own. Like I said, they're on the schedule. But if they catch sight of you before they leave, you'll have to contend with them too. Well, frankly... Because we'd have to go up and over this hill. And Kamea does not have jump jets. And... APCs move pretty damn fast, so we'd be coming in from behind. I say we just go around here, head them off here. I'm on my way. We just kind of got to keep everyone together, otherwise we're all going to split up. Get on that road. That'll definitely help. pretty much together for this. Okay. I hear ya. So glitch. Could come all the way up here. Can't jump up there though. APC has reached the refueling depot. Take out the escorts. See, we just, we even just got here at the same time. Alright, we're already taking fire, but that is the priority target right there. Waiting for orders. Now, can everyone get up here to fire, though? That's the thing. Not really. So, unfortunately, I really kind of need everyone to come together first before we go wasting more time this way. I want to know what's shooting at me, because I don't have anything other than this APC on my visual. I feel like I should pull her back. She doesn't even have... Got it. Okay. Now, if I sensor lock, I can still see it. Which means I can continue to fire with my assault mechs. Okay, we got another mech coming in, it looked like. Nope, tank. 35. That won't be too bad. Might just be able to take out some of that armor from long distance, which would be great. So we can pop over that hill now, take down that turret. As long as we're still kind of hidden here, I think we'll be fine. Now, oh, of course, there's another one. I copy. Okay. So that one is down. One left turret. More vehicles incoming. I say we just kind of stay in this ridge, in, the, in this little canyon here. Maybe pull over to the forest? That would be a good trick. Although, getting close enough to just blast it would also be useful. I'm exposing myself the more I go, though. But I can't... can't get a clean shot on it otherwise. This is a blocked shot for some reason. And this probably is getting me close to the turrets and everything. It, we, need, we need it to come to me. I gotta take this slow. 
They can all see me there. withstand the peppering of missiles. It's just, we gotta let this stuff come to me. I'm not sure what just happened there, but it missed. Because the thing about this now is that these, mis these, these vehicles are nothing if we can get into melee. If I can just jump on everybody, then we're totally cool. But it's getting them to come to me is the trick. Roger that. Cause see, they just have way too much armor. Vehicles have an excessive amount of armor to try and shoot them down. So they're just no good for that. It's a waste of time to, to try and engage vehicles that way. Alright, I'll try and get you out of there if I ever get a fucking turn. Jesus. Reporting. That's why we need to hide over here. Major armor loss. No shit, huh? Fuck. Orders. Say we just reserve, see what comes my way, a little bit closer. If anything comes into range that I can actually use to, to pop up. What can I do for you? You betcha. I really think we just need to kind of hang out over here, and then once they pop through in any kind of range, then go just jump on them and stomp them like bugs. Still able to see me. I could do the same trick. Let's see, we just stand still. Sensor lock one and just fire missiles at another. She's going to weather all that fire. That's the shitty thing, is that she would... She would be weathering all of that by herself. Maybe I should just get them all up on this ridge. Again, ridges have always been my friend. I just can't take on that much by myself. Operating. Engage. Reading loud and clear. Affirmative. In a very bullshit way, the computer seems to know that it can't get closer to me. I probably should just be doing long range against that damn turret, because 
that turret's what's sensor locking me. So I should be sensor locking it and just throw tons of LRMs at it. That should be how I'm handling this. And that guy is gonna be a little bastard. So let's do that. Ah, oh, it's out of my own fucking range. Of course it is. Gotta walk. Okay, there's a striker there. Aye, aye. Coward. See, now this suicidal AI that would otherwise be charging the hell out of me is now deciding, hmm, I can't do that. Good to go. Engaging jump. Firing on target. You have my attention. Well, I'm not gonna play the computer's game, so it can come to me. Piece by piece, and if we gotta take an hour to do this damn mission, we'll do it. That 55er is coming my way, though. I want to be able to have a shootout with it across this gap. It is taking forever to get here, though. We're going to use up all our missiles doing this. We really need to be focused on taking that out. Because I don't have this many more missiles. I just realized that. Well, we do. You don't. But getting you up there and exposed is not a brilliant idea either. What are those? Turret generators? Oh. Well, shit me. I'd been paying attention to that. You think it's worth it to run up in there? That's an awful lot of firepower to weather. What do those have? A piece? No. 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 God damn it. I just want to see what they have. Probably too much. Too much to split, I'm sure. And that guy is coming. We've got to be doing something other than what I'm currently doing. Because it's just not working. I'm exposing myself no matter what I do here. If I got lucky, I could totally do that. I just don't want any of his other stuff to go anywhere else. I think we might be able to handle this. I copy. There we go. Reporting. That's what we needed. So now it's the rest of this that I gotta worry about. Which is not good. Not good at all. Could multi target. Let's just make sure we kill one, though, huh? Discharging weapon. If that's not enough to kill it, then I think we're in trouble. So. They've got a sensor lock on me. Standing by. I copy. Giving him everything. 
everything I've got. Reporting. Yeah, it's just these turrets. I feel like we should just take out those turret generators. Unfortunately, I don't have a good shot for all my weapons, so... Okay. I need to back off there. Get out of range of those turrets. Didn't need to do that, but... Come on! Okay. Get everyone over here so that they can all... take a whack at those turret generators all at one go. down seriously Confirmed. Pierce through the armor. at least we got him knocked down That's it. Last of the escorts is down and the APC is ours. Alexander, can you hear me? What the hell just happened? Alexander! Don't worry about your precious pet, cousin. I have him right here with me, safe and sound. You, on the other hand, are anything but safe. You should have killed me when you had the chance. New sensor contacts. I've got hostile units converging on your location. Damn you, Victoria. Taking hostages is a coward's move. If you wanted to fight me, you should have come yourself. When I send you to hell, be sure to tell Lord Carosas that. Boy, I'm nervous about getting him anywhere near any of this. We're about to lose that arm. That arm has my very good laser. So, got ambushers coming my way. We need to destroy the destroy those turrets because this is yes. we're just not going to do this. Good to go. She does have sensor lock, which is unfortunate because she's far more useful to me by actually firing something. And I can't see these, even though I've got. I don't want to waste my missiles anymore, though. I 
All right. Well, we're going to have to have her up and out there doing multiple damage on multiple things. Which could be very bad. Especially getting him out there too. Actually, I kind of want to wait for everybody to have their turn. So let's have everybody have a turn. Okay, because we all need to do this all at once. I don't know what we're waiting on. Clearly that's our next target. But we got to get everybody up here first. Commander. So, we'll be jumping here. And then multi-targeting this stuff. 100, 100 points apiece. Okay, well with the Gauss rifle and medium laser, maybe I should do two medium lasers just to be on the safe side? No. We can take out two. I say we take out those ones. Okay, that's probably not going to do it. Although, two missiles, two of those... Well, no, 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 I'm looking at it that wrong. That's all we can hit with that, okay. So that's got to work then. But that means pretty much all of those missiles have to hit. We need five of the twenty missiles to hit. We need six of the twenty missiles to hit. Firing on multiple okay, that's one down. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Seriously, like, just sitting there at one. No, okay, good, we got it. Fuck. Okay, we don't have to waste our time on this now. Good. So now we can take this slow and steady, right? We don't need to kill this, because there's no turret left. So we're gonna slow and steady our way up and over there. Again, we'll just do it, but we'll conserve ammo. Firing. Really? Target destroyed. Okay. Now getting that thunderbolt out front is not I know, I know I got it, thank you. How do I want to do this? Do we want to try and climb the ridge? She doesn't Arano doesn't have maybe we should take this back road. I didn't even see this back road. Take this back road over here so we can stand on a hill. I think we should do that. I, hear ya. I think that's how we should play that. Uh -huh. The director must have learned about Lord Madeira's transponder and cloned the signal. Keep fighting down there. Samira and I are working on a fix on his actual location. Work quickly. This could be our only chance to find him. Okay, now they're coming my way. Okay. Well, I think I'm going to end this one here. We'll deal with whatever this is next time.